for the Apostolic Church Nigeria where they for Ujeb community, Central Field in Jeloko area headquarters. And today you they see say the family, the friends and guests will come from far and wide, come pet their brother and friend. His Excellency Ambassador Umfawa Omini Abam. As them come tell them, say, do where your mama pass. We day here to support you. Open and day here to give you the reading gist. My name still be Babita. Is she? Uh, my name is uh, Sir Roland Anye Chuku Ndukuba. I'll be the national president of Nigerians in Italy. Today we came um, for the funeral of uh, Mama Ambassador. And uh, we came to we come say make we appreciate Ambassador and show him solidarity because his mama is a very good person and uh, to, to to tell him not to cry too much for the for his mama death. Mm. Thank you very much, sir. Do you get any other thing to add? No, what I need, uh, what I get to add is. Um, First, let me appreciate all Nigerians waiting there for Italy for their massive contributions where they do to help support uh, our ambassador in their only two way. We say we appreciate them. We say may God bless all of them. And uh, we don't come here. We don't do what we're supposed to do. And we pray that may, may God accept uh, her soul. Uh, that's, that, that's, the, that's the message. Thank you, okay, sir. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, my name is uh, Igwe Chima Ibezin. Now, I come because let uh, me be the president of uh, our Nigerian people where they roam, where ambassador they. And let me be also the person where they represent the all the dignitaries and personalities where they Italy where the ambassador friend where they, they call committee of friends so I mean they represent them here to show say this is our ambassador and a better person his excellency for how many album is a, a better ambassador ambassador way in humble for heart for everything and uh, in mama he trained and well so as this kind of thing happened to them we say we have to come and uh, we suppose come show and say in get people for italy we in south in get people we like the better thing we in they do for us we be nigerian people for italy so we say may we come stay with them tell us may, may god give him an in family mind May they forbear the death of Mama, and may God they continue to bless them and the family. So I'm here as uh, a friend and a person. We you know say ambassador and a better person, and we need to deal with them. Thank you very much, sir. My name is Ali Ukasidi. What I know about Mama, Mama is a very courageous person and humble very respectful and somebody that has a fear of god sorry oh, pardon my mixture of english mama gets fear of god she be very uh, uh god fearing woman and I, I i discovered something when i was going through a tribute and all that that mama she's somebody that is very caring somebody that have empathy somebody that likes people like to help people she's somebody that unite people unify her she's a peacemaker she's a lover of god and uh, she's very humble like what i told you she's very very humble and she's accommodating and uh, somebody that wish people were and want people to be to, to put smiles on people's face he want everybody around her to be happy so that's the kind of thing i can describe mama because i can see that replicate i can see that same thing that exemplar in the life of the um, uh, son that's the ambassador abam if anyone, that's the a Nigerian ambassador to Italy. I see that replicate because the man too is a very humble man, very calm man, somebody that have understanding, you know. So I see that replicating in the sun. So I believe that Mama has gone to be with the Lord. 
and uh, we thank God that we are celebrating her. It's a celebration of life, 83, that is not the son that she's bearing, it's the son that is bearing her. So that's our wish for everybody. So I think people should emulate her and look at the life that she has lived. So it's time for us now to come together and see how to, we can make an impact on people's life, you know, positive impact, so that people can remember us, for just like Mama, the legacies that she has put behind, that everybody is a caring mother, caring mother, caring mother, caring mother, you know, we should try and see how we can love ourselves and live together as one, very important, so that we can take our life to next level, to that glorious destiny that we are all glamouring for. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, to commiserate and condole with uh, Ambassador Abang. We know him as a nice person and uh, we believe uh, it's a transparency of what the mother has uh, injected into him. You understand? I don't know my mind in person, but I have a brief uh, history and story about her. So I believe she, uh, without me saying anything, with a lot have been said around and uh, you can see the crowd here. You should know how people know how important she is in the life of people from the streets of our house to this place. You can see how people are trooping in, you know, like showing their last respect. So we are also here to, you know, show our own last respect to Mama on behalf of our own uh, small uh, uh, this thing, community. So my name is uh, Prince Dr. Abdul Ahmed Jikantoro. Yeah. So thank you very much. My name is Engineer Nsa Ekwanyong Asukwa. Uh, we're actually here to, uh, you know, to see how we can support our friend for the burial of his uh, mother. You know, Mama, you know, in person, is not someone I know. I don't know how they find this But uh, you can tell by the fruits of any plant, you can tell what that plant is. Mama saw who is Ambassador Abba. It's someone that is a very loving person. You know, someone that is transparent, someone that cares about other people. As an ambassador, most times, he will leave what he's doing to ensure that I'm always okay whenever I'm in Italy. In all my visit in Italy, he comes to pick me from the airport. No, I said, ah, this man uh, has a good heart. You know, I was at the Netherlands when I got the news of the, uh, his sudden uh, demise of the mom. And I said, no, I will have to be around. All because of the character of his son. Thank you. Thank you very much. Still spoke correct in English, but okay. This is my beautiful wife, Esther David Otu. Uh, I'm actually the niece to late Mrs. Uh, Miss Eno, who happens to be my auntie. Uh, she was fun and loving to be with. I could remember back in the days when I used to live with her. She was always caring. Always uh, showing that motherly love to everyone. Yeah. And uh, I will never forget the fact that she lost her profession, which is teaching, until the day she finally retired. So having her, having to lose her in a day like this, is really sad to everyone. Well, all I can say in summary is that may her soul continue to rest in the bosom of the Lord Almighty. Thank you very much. Good afternoon. My name is Esther David Otsu. Although I did not meet Mama earlier, but I know and I heard she's a good woman. Very funny woman that you can be with. So I really feel sad to miss her this period of a time. That I wish to enjoy her, but I miss her. 
So you swell. May the Lord receive our bosom in Jesus' name. What's in your relationship with Mama? Okay. My name is Mrs. Elizabeth Onoko. Yeah. Uh, from Anambra. My name is Mrs. Elizabeth Onoko from Anambra State. We are in law to Mama. No, uh, Akbam. Uh, she's a nice in law. We love her and she loved us. The relationship has been so cordial. Uh, uh, to her death, we appreciate God for what God has done. Even though we lament of her demise, because we have not been expecting that she will depart by this stage. At least we are hope we are we are we are we are anticipating that at least she will stay more 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 years like. More 15 years or 20 years, as the Lord wish. We thank you. We know her as a a, a a unique mother, a woman that is no a, a woman of uh, visions, a noble woman. She took care of her children very well, and we are we are we are we are very happy about her lifestyle. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, ma'am. Omini Abba, mm -hmm. uh, Ambassador. Uh, 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 well, uh, I cannot call myself His Excellency. Uh, people will address me His Excellency. Uh, well, um, I'm the first child of my parents. Mm -hmm. uh, this was not just my mother. I buried my father two years ago. Uh, but like I said in church, it looks like my father wants uh, the wife. Uh, to join him and then probably like I also said uh, maybe God asked my father when he saw him he said where is your wife you know and then decided to bring her so they decided to go at that close space yeah but it's okay we thank God because the the kind of life my father and my mother lived mm -hmm. uh, you, I mean you could just see it uh, around as you see people like this if they were bad people you would not see what we are seeing today uh, it goes to show you the kind of life they lived, the kind of people they were. They were both teachers. Mm -hmm. They taught here. Most of, 85% of all the people here, you either pass through my father or my mother. Mm -hmm. So that's why you see everybody coming here to pay their last respects you know, to them. So, uh, well, it's like telling your story by yourself. I wish somebody else is telling you about my parents. Then you will understand what it means. They were just elementary school teachers, primary school teachers, and they ended up as headmasters. But they impacted a lot on the community. They impacted a lot, not just the community, but in and around, you know, the local government. They have taught in so many schools, as you have seen in our biography, in my mother's biodata. My father's was even richer, you know. So we grew up as children of teachers. Mm -hmm. I passed through this primary school. You are seeing here. My classroom is right there. I've played football here. I've passed here going to the stream to fetch water and going to farm. You know, all these people you see greeting me. They knew me growing up playing football here and running around here almost naked. So I grew up here and they brought me up very well. They were very strict parents. Mm -hmm. I tell you, my father never told any lie. You had to kill him, you know. And then for my mother, you see, if you need a virtuous woman, a woman who is a woman, a church woman, a devout Christian, my father married her right inside the church. Mm? And they both sang in the choir. Mm? My father died as an elder in the church. She died as a deaconess in the church. So we are all Christ very good Christians. Uh? Even though now I can't sing very well, but maybe that I don't have that gift. Yes, but I grew up in Sunday school. And I think that has uh, manifested in the life I have lived. For me to become an ambassador, coming from here. You know? Okay. So what do you promise them? My parents. What do you promise them? I don't need to promise again. I have almost lived my life. And they have seen me before they died become an ambassador. And I took very good care of them. So I can't promise them more than to do more than I have done. And to live a better life than I have lived already. You know? 
and probably to help and bring up the younger ones okay. so that they will follow suit. So, mm, so. an environment in a climate where a lot of crimes. Yeah. So what will Nigerian learn from your mother to better mm. a society like our country? Well, it's the same thing we have learned from her to be good children and to always be honest and know and tell the truth mm, and above all to know God. Everything you do without God, nothing, you know. Mm. To live that kind of life, my parents lived, my mother lived. If you live that kind of life, you will never be the same. Way. You see your children grow up the way you want them to grow up. Mm. And then the citizen, of course, everybody, eh, you will get the kind of citizenry you, we expect, we want. I'm sure if we're, if we're all brought up, grown up by the kind of parents I have uh, in this world, there will be no crime. Mm. Uh -huh. Just not to disappoint their parents and to be, uh, you know, good children, uh, God-fearing children, God-fearing people, the way they wanted us to be and we were. So, gentlemen, I think uh, the interview is taking too long. People are idle, people are going to... At this stage, and I think we can uh, stop here so far. And then I want to thank you, even you, to the media, because without you, nobody will know what is happening here. Uh -huh. So, well, thank you once again, you know, for at least coming to honor my mother, pay her last, her last respects to her, and for accepting to come to this village. I know where you all are coming from. So I wish you all a safe journey back to your different destinations. Thank you much for coming. My mama will don't die. Now my mama will we no go feel forget to, for life. Mama bring us up, all of us together. He teach us say anything won't be your own. Make you know to take a look another person own. This thing where they give you won't be your own. No, they look say another person own. They they won't big pass your own. Make you carry that one whole lamb, take and whole body. Make you know they look outside. He said, when you they see food for outside, make you know they look, say, the people, they chop big, big meat outside, though. Even me, even a small, small fish, what they give you for house here. Now, the one where I get, where God give me to give you, make you day content with that one where I give you. Now, the kind of mama where we get. Mama where go sit down. But all the Pekins went there for this war. People, children go come. Mama go make sure, say, as they break till they come close, he go, they cook, they give people, go, they cook, they give people. Now, the kind of mama where I've been get. Mama, where be? So, this is not teacher where he be before, uh -huh, before he die. Mama, where we get? Eh, ah, if you come up from school, come, come back. She go sit down with you for table. After you don't talk, finish. He go, they ask you what they teach you. He go, they look at me. He go, they look at me. The side where you know do and well, he go tell you, say, make you change that like this. So that tomorrow you go, Sabi, the, the thing when they teach you for school. Now they come, Mama, where I get. My Mama, when I've been small, that time I seen brother will be ambassador. Don't go. Uh, secondary school, they live for body house. Now only me been in the house, I did 12 years. My mama won't go to school. My mama look me, I be boy, yo. Mama teach me, like saying they teach woman for house. Make her they cook, make her they take care of my younger ones. I go wake up, I bath them, so that we go follow, go school. And that thing when you come teach me. Now I carry now, the wife where I marry, I they take care of them. Anytime when I want to enter kitchen, come cook. My children, they happy where well, where. Well. Now children, they're happy well, well, because mama knows him teach me how to cook, to take care of them. I go take care of her, she go sweet me. That lesson, I know they forget, forget them for life. Now, so I take grow. He teach me, make I respect my senior brother. My senior brother tell me, say, make I stand for this son from morning, take rich night. Now, here I go stand. Now, mama tell me, oh, I know they disobey him. Right. And I saw children, when they do not follow me, we know they disobey each other. Last question. Wait till me, mama best color. My mama best color. Now white. Okay. Uh, she go come carry a uh, cloth where they get flour when they blue. put them for her shoulder. They take the worker. Okay. I take the If you serve for church, they dance with that cloth. Eh? You go carry hanky when they white. You hold her like this. You go they shake waist. <laughs> you go they shake waist. Thank now. you very much. Sir. Blessing comes about. And I be mama grandchild. Okay. Mama now, one person where we say, the most thing where you remember about them now, she they always come to for person. Like, you know, if you need something, you meet mama, she turn, she, she turn you down. Whether it's day or you know day, she go find way and she go come to for you. Okay, it's be mama's color, if you remember at all. 
Mm-hmm. Okay, so if I want to throw a wild guess, I could say green or blue. Green or blue. You know her best food? Mama likes to chop eba very well. She chops all the way away. All right, thank you very What's much. Your name? I'm Majesty. Uh-uh. Your name is Majesty? Yes, no, my name is Majesty Timothy Akasi. Okay, now you can talk Majesty Timothy. How you feel today? Ah, I just feel good. I thank God. After the Thanksgiving, we want to ask you, what me your memories with Grandma? How will I take leave? How you take Siam when she's alive? One thing where I know about my grandma, we say, my grandma, she has a heart for giving. Even when she appeared before God, she knew they call him. Even we said, as we follow her like this, God just give us one, one K as it seems to be. Everybody will just, I just love the way, even her work out, the way she they take three them. Everybody, she must reward you very, ah, my grandma. I just love her for that. Okay, thank you very much, Timothy. <laughs> my name is Esther Timothy Akase. Hey, the grandma, mama of Grand Pekin. Yes. Waiting be her best food. Um, her best food na tree leaf yam. Tree leaf yam. <laughs> yes. Okay. For as many people, people we know the tree leaf yam. Waiting be her best color. Um, she loves white, white color. You know her shoe size. To be forty. Forty. She talk I'm like say she's sure. Like now nah, she they buy a shoe for him. Thank you so much. <laughs> Give it to me your name. My name. My name is Janet Okoy Ibo. Oh, I'm the sister. I'm the person that follow Mama for back. Oh. Yes. Can you tell us your memories of Mama. How I take you out? How Mama? Mama, she is good to me. She is kind. She is my friend. Anything I need, Mama will give me. Do hmm? you remember Mama best color? Color of cloth or what? Yes, color of cloth. Hmm? So, like. She like white. Okay. Thank you very you much, Ma. Wait to be your name. My name is Faith Timothy Akase. And you be Mama? First daughter. Right, we get first daughter for you. Since as first daughter, how you take carry the family along? Where you say, now you can be the Mama of the house. In fact, you know, there is you. As Mama can't leave us, my senior brother will be ambassador. Tell me, say, now you be the Mama now. No? In fact, now, now God will just help me. Because to be Mama, not be small work. But by the grace of God, I did try. Seriously. And after all your trying, you feel on a scale of one to ten, how you feel say so you don't bring them together? The day mama died, she keep me for room throughout. Come they beg me, say tell me, as I go like this. I want una all to stay in peace. Make una no make trouble. Small time she will repeat that thing again. She will see I'm again and again, again and again. And God can't help us today. All of us, where they do quarrel, where they fight, where they argue every time, God put us together. We are now one family. All of us yesterday come to our brother house. If you see the way where we the gist, the way where we the play, everybody can't shock. Even my sister, why they follow me? He said, peace don't rain for this family. I say, yes, we give God praise. We're going to give us peace. Yes. Thank you very much, ma'am. Mm. My name is uh, Obal Abam Awara. Mm. <laughs> you say make you put your title. Okay. Elder Mrs. Obal Abam Awara. You be mama, second picking, second daughter. I be mama, second daughter. Mm. As mama, second daughter, I'm saying you be the second mama of the house. So how you don't say help the family come together? You know, say my mama, as she find rich, that's so her heart fine. But then she teach me, make her no forget for this life, not to love people. And always I they keep to it. My house is always open for everybody, especially my mama grandchildren. I know they keep them aside. I make sure 
I cook waiting my mama teach me to cook, give them. And her best soup na mold melon. White. Then we go come garnish them with the leaf where we they call it paladidi. And she tell me say that soup na welcome soup to uh, we we all. So every time na that soup where they cook when I no say my siblings they come around. You feel tell us if you feel remember mama best food. You feel tell us mama best color. <laughs> my mother like blue very well because she is a apostolic member. Thank you so much, Ma. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.